Hello, good evening everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Dot Hack GU Last Recode Volume 1 Rebirth, and this is episode 17. And in the last episode, a lot of important stuff happened. Um, uh, Haseo's team participated in the first Demon Palace, uh, Demon Palace, uh, fight against Bordeaux and her team, even though it was just Haseo and Adelie. And Haseo was able to awaken to his avatar. Old man Terrace. What does he want? He's at Lumina Cloth, huh? Yeah, that's right. Old man Antares wants me to meet him right now. And also, Coon, I think Coon wants me to go and, uh... Yeah, Coon wants me to go with him to this area to learn how to control my avatar. So anyways, Haseo awakens his avatar and uses it to instantly win against, uh... Bordeaux and her team, even though it wasn't really instantly, since I did actually, uh, f I was actually fighting her, and I would have actually won, <laughs> I would have won even without my avatar if the game had let me, but nope, it just, you know, forces you into the cutscene, so Haseo awakened to his avatar, and Kun wasn't happy about that, <laughs> because he, he was like, you know, I could have, made them lose consciousness in real life you know make them go into a coma IRL uh, but Haseo is like oh it's all good I'll just use whatever weapons I want and so yeah Kun kinda doesn't like me right now um yeah I like I am sorry about my descriptions for the episodes up until this point I've had them like completely wrong because I haven't been really reviewing the videos too well. <laughs> oh my gosh. So it's like I kind of forgot what content I had in them. Because it I record these like in advance. And then I upload them. And so it's like by the time I start uploading them. I've pretty much forgotten what happened in each of the episodes. And I can't really tell going, going off of the... Uh, going off of the uh the picture for the video because you know okay whatever so anyways yeah let's let's just start playing <laughs> it's been a while since i last uh was able to start playing but i've got a lot of days off unfortunately i am gonna have to start watching my uh, little niece coming up soon because my mom's going out of town but okay that's enough in information there Let's go and see what Antares wants. <laughs> so, you won first round? Yeah. Well, <coughs> I guess that's only natural. After all, you are my disciple. When did I become your disciple? <coughs> I want you to meet some people. I'm his Ooh. disciple. Come. Hmm. He wants me to meet some people. Ah, huh. we're heading over in the opposite direction of the arena to this other giant building. So the arena is over there, and that's where bowing. What is this over here? Well, let's find let's out. Hey, where are we going? To Ecolo's headquarters. Ecolo? A crazy guild where the requirement to join is to be an arena emperor. Why are we going there? Wait a second. You can't get inside other ad homes without a key. Here. Huh? This is. He had the key? Why do you... How? Shut up. Just shut <laughs> your mouth and come shut with me. Shut up. The way he says that is so funny. I almost dropped my controller for a second trying to take a drink. Yes, this is Ecolo's at home. And once again, I forgot to pay attention to what time I started this at. I think I started at 10.55. Wow, you know what? It's pretty early for me to be awake. Serious? 
How you doing, Lord Emperor of the Holy Palace? <laughs> huh? You mean this guy's an Arena Emperor too? He doesn't look that strong. <coughs> And Terrace, what's the meaning of this? Nothing at all. I just came to show my disciple here the famous Ecolo headquarters. I told you, I'm not your disciple. Listen up, Aunt Terrace. This is a citadel for the Chosen Ones, a place for brave warriors, not a place where any outsider can just waltz in. Especially not for someone who abandoned Ecolo like you did. Do not disturb our order. Is that what you think, too? Come out and say hello, Taihaku. Oh, did hey, he there's get another here? Guy. There's no need to worry. I will honor your <laughs> intent. After all, you are the founder of Ecolo. This guy, I think I've seen him somewhere. <laughs> That's my Taihaku. Unlike some greenhorn brat, you know your manners. But why not just speak frankly? That Ecolo's order doesn't mean anything. And Terrace, you bastard! <coughs> huh, who the hell is this guy? How should I know? We're in the middle of something. Get out of here! Wow, that's rude. Is she a member of Ecolo too? She's an ex Ecolo, just the same as me. Now let's see. She's participating in the Demon Palace Tournament like you. So I guess that would mean she'll be one of your rivals as well. Rival? Yep. Who? You mean this? He looks weak. What did you say? Whoa, Haseo. You're the one messing Don't around. Hit a girl. What are you, some kind of noob? Don't you know the name Alcade, Demon Palace Emperor? <sighs> Former, Former Emperor. Yeah. Shut the hell up. The current Emperor is Endrance, because you lost to him. Shut up, you stupid telephone pole. I'll reclaim my place. You stupid telephone <laughs> pole. Don't act like a sore loser. Got it? Listen, noob. You and I are on totally different levels. Yeah, well, I'm gonna level up. I will up. be the one to defeat Endrance. There's no place for you in this fight. Like hell! I am gonna be the one to defeat Endrance. What was that? You're talking trash. But when it comes down to it, you lost to him. That's why you left Ecolo. Shut up! I only lost last time because I let my guard down. <laughs> I'll definitely win against him next time. You kind of sound like a boy. That's enough, you two. Let's Wait, what? go, Haseo. She already left. What do you mean that's enough, you two? She already left. I don't get what he meant there. I guess Man, that line was a little woman late. Pisses me off. Sorry about all the coughing, you know. That's the current state of Ecolo. Huh? But I guess that's my favorite Pokemon. A guild master coughing. that has lost his zeal. And <coughs> members who have nothing at all except for their empty pride. Can this be? Is this the Ecolo that I envisioned? I don't know. What is the Ecolo oh. you envisioned? Like, seriously, what did you expect? 
When I saw your fight at the arena, when I saw how eagerly you fought, this dried up old man thought to himself, I thought it would be interesting if he became an emperor. Oh gee, thanks. You liked my character's design that much? Like seriously. I don't care about what you find interesting or not, but I am going to become the emperor. Yeah. Oh, you have new mail. Okay. Let's go and check my mail. So, lately I've been playing a lot of Pokemon Ultra Moon. I'm finally almost done with it, even though it's been out for a long time. I still haven't, like, finished it. Alright, well, let's check some of the stuff. <coughs> oh, only new stuff in App Kalu. What? Kitty Haseo? Oh my god. I guess some people actually do love Haseo. Yeah, see? I knew I had a cool character design. And there's new stuff in the movies, but I'm not gonna watch them. I should just like... Yeah, do that to get rid of it. And see, I unlocked another movie, but I can't view this yet because it's a long ways away. Well, I guess it's not that long till I get to that. And then this is for those new background images I picked up and all that. Yes. See, I already have 41 out of 83 of the uh, background images. It, not that it's difficult to get all of them, like seriously. Alright, let's check the mail. Ooh. Yada investigation. I have Pi stationed at Mach Anu's Chaos Gate. Join her as soon as possible. Talk to Pi for details and follow her orders. I've got to cooperate if I want more information on Triage, huh? Damn Yada. Why am I only going with Pi, though? Why not Pi and Coon? Alright, well, let's go. I should probably change the background image on my computer. Just saying. I don't know. Having Natalie stare at me 24-7 is a little bit unsettling. I'll do that next time. You know, I, I just have to figure out which background image I want to use. Oh, hey, speak of the devil. Our current mission is to investigate a certain area. Ida? Yes. A faint response has been detected in that area. It's perfect for someone like you who has just awakened. This perfect. mission doubles Thank as your you. training. You will do as I say, and nothing else. Is that perfectly clear? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yes, right. ma'am. Then invite me into your party. The area we'll be heading to is Delta Delicious Pass Weed Eater. Whoa! Also, just to let you know, I like that name it'll just for be that you area. And me on this mission. Keep that in mind. Ugh. What was that? Eh. No, nothing, ma'am. Nothing. Nothing at all. I didn't say anything. Del Delta Delicious Past Weed Eater. Oh my god. This is like the perfect area name for me. Okay, I yeah, I'm definitely Wow, everyone else is offline. Jeez. Thanks guys for being so interactive. Not really. Um I already gave you guys all flyers. Yep, I already gave all of them flyers, apparently. Okay, well let's do this. Man, it sucked. The last time I tried recording, though, uh... Oh. What? I thought I did this area. Yeah, I could have sworn I did this area. Oh, yeah, that's right. I got interrupted. That's right. I remember now. Um, you know what? I might as well wait to do that area. Yeah, let's just go here now. 
<laughs> See, I what have I to do that before. area though. You will follow my orders throughout this mission. Have you got that? You already said this. All right already. You. Do you want to end up like Shino? What? Whoa. You heard from Yada. You think all you have to do is dangle that? Like master, like servant, huh? It's not funny. How many times do I have to tell you an avatar is a dangerous, hard to control power? In that sense, they aren't very far removed from Ida or Triedge. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. We Epitaph users are connected to our characters on a mental and spiritual level. Data drain is the power to alter data. If your avatar goes berserk, that power will flow back into your own character. If that happens to you, Haseo, you may become a lost one too. Oh, okay, so she cares. okay, I got it. Whatever. Until I can fully control my avatar, I'll do whatever you say. There. Are you happy now? Yes. Alright, well, I might as well use a, uh. Oh, I don't have one? Oh, I do have some fairies orbs. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I, I pretty much always just use fairies orbs. What? I, I wasn't trying to go into first person. I was trying to look at the map, but... See those sparkling things? Yeah, that's Ida. Let's go and... Let's go and meet Ida. Be I'm careful, joking. Or you'll get pulled into the other side of the hole. Other side? It's on the other side. Lost grounds? I've already been there. Whoa. And here it comes, the Avatar Awakening. Scathe! Scathe. Yep, that's one of the, uh... One of the, uh, epitaphs from the original game. And now, welcome to the first to the Avatar Ida. battle. First, you will need to get its HP down to zero, then perform a Protect Break on it. Yep. Protect Break? What's that? You'll understand once you get its HP down to zero. Yep. If you get its HP down to zero, then perform a Protect Break. So, you pretty much dash with O. Okay, I'm trying to explain stuff here, thank you. And you can use X to attack with your sight. <coughs> yep, I know. Indicators that show it's going to attack. She pretty much keeps just explaining, and then you can shoot with square. Ow, I'm trying to... Oh my gosh, I am doing terribly here. Eventually, when you hit the enemy enough times, there we go. You'll be able to go in and slash them and do a lot of damage. Because you pretty much break their defense. Ah, oh my gosh. I'm trying to explain so many things right now, but it's like... Eh. I have to focus on the actual gameplay too. That's why it's kind of hard to do live commentary. But yes, this is live commentary. Oh. Flick those away. Oh, no, no. Anyways, so yeah, this is all really just like stuff that's based off of the. Uh, oh my gosh. This is all stuff that is based off of the original Dot Hack games. Like, for example, Haseo's, um, Haseo's Avatar Scathe is, uh, clearly based off of the first of the bosses, like, the first major boss that you have to fight in the original Dot Hack games. 
because in the original dot hack games there were these monsters that were like unkillable monsters known as the eight phases of the wave and when I say unkillable, I don't really mean unkillable, like they actually did have HP and after you would hit them a certain number of times, uh, they would go into this protect break mode where you would be able to data drain them and you then... You the protect break. Yes, I know, Pi. So you would do the protect break on them and then their actual HP and then you would be able to data drain them and then their actual HP will be shown and then you'll finally be able to just fight them till their HP reaches zero and kill them but they were you know the strongest bosses in the game and so in in this game since Haseo is like Pi and Kun how we're like the people who can control these avatars we each control one of the eight phases of the wave, and Haseo just happens to control the first of the eight phases of the wave, which is, um, Scathe, the Terror of Death. You mean we can't defeat it even if we get its HP down to zero? Yes, that's right. To completely immobilize Ida, we need to absorb its configuration data with data drain. Yep, and see these enemies are exactly the same, except for all we have to do is just do data drain on them. Data drain. These are just like basic avatar enemies. Don't though. waste time. We can only use data drain effectively when Ida's protection is disabled like it is now. Ida's protection will recover itself after a while. Yep. So when the anyways, is full, yeah. Release the button to fire it. Even if your opponent is moving fast, it will stop for a split second. Use Data Drain at that exact moment. Alright, so now you have to charge it up and try not to get hit. And now you have to pretty much aim for the perfect moment to fire and hit it. And there you go, Data Drain. Yeah, so I've been playing the new Pokemon Ultra Moon, and I'm almost done with it. I've also been playing Stardew Valley. And ring. Summoning more than one avatar will cause interference, and thus increases the chance for them to go berserk. Oh, okay. As it is now, the most effective method is to support a single avatar. Huh, interesting. Alright. After our Scathe's strength is proportional to Haseo's character level, Scathe will get stronger as Haseo levels up. So, yes. Three Ida signals left in this area. So there are still more there's still more Ida in this area. Might as well keep progressing. And of course, as I just read, you know. Skate, uh, skate gets stronger the stronger Haseo gets, so it makes a lot of sense to just keep fighting enemies and keep leveling up. These enemies are good because I can get Rengekis on them. Although these enemies are a little bit uh, low level and weak. Yeah, see, I'm not getting very much experience for these things. That's the only problem. This will be quick. Yeah. All right, got a Rigdecky. Yeah, I yeah, I'm not gonna fight a ton of these enemies. I'm just gonna fight enough of them, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> So yeah, I've also been playing Stardew Valley, and that's a fun game. Oh, Ringeki of the Century, sweet. I got a new trophy. Awesome. It's a good thing that doesn't, like, stop my gameplay recording. Okay, 
let's try and just avoid some of these enemies. Since I don't have to fight all of them. Oh, and here are some more items. Yeah, I think I said it in my original Let's Play, but there was this girl in my school when I was in high school, and her name was actually Ida. Alright, and so this time it just instantly puts us in the Avatar battle. Ow, and I'm instantly getting hit. Alright, so just keep shooting. You want to just keep shooting it and lowering that bar. And so if you can get all three to hit, you will be able to, you know, paralyze it for a short period of time and go in for the kill. Or not go in for the kill, but just go in and do massive damage. And see, one more, one more time and it should be done. Algol Laser. Interesting name for an attack, you know. I haven't researched, you know, all the naming and stuff in this uh, game, but I bet that uh, attack has a interesting, you know. Can I not? Thank you. I was like trying to get it to do that, but all right, protect break. <coughs> yeah, don't get hit though. Because if you get hit while charging up, obviously it's going to, you know. Bam! Obviously it's going to interrupt your attack, or your data drain. And then you have to start charging again. Alright, two Ida signals left. Alright, got a treasure chest. Okay, let's go down. Let's go down this way. So... Okay, yeah, screw you guys. Um, I don't think there's any way to actually avoid being seen by these enemies, but luckily they don't chase you, so I can just kind of skirt around them. Yeah, I can kind of just like walk in between these guys and get this treasure chest. Uh, there's, uh, there's another treasure chest on this side, right here. And then there's something back this way. I don't know. Probably just some more enemies. Or not. What the? It's literally just a wide open room. Obey my orders. Got that? Yes, Mistress Pie. I'm joking. <coughs> Seriously, though. Pie is, like, so bossy. I like the fact that I can literally just walk past all these enemies. Even though I probably should just be fighting them. Like, see, these guys... Oh, no, these guys don't chase me down either. Alright, well, let's fight these things. They're lizard assassins. Boom, boom. Alright, that was pretty good. Don't kill it yet. Yes, ring game. Alright, three Ringekis. That's pretty good. That was nothing. Okay, see that was a decent amount of experience. Maybe I should grind a little bit. I was about to say, when are you going to go into your Regeki mode? Alright, here we go, another Regeki. Alright, so at least I got two Regekis off. 
Yeah, but see, those enemies definitely don't give as much experience as the lizard enemies. Oh, my computer's dying. <laughs> yeah, I've been playing Stardew Valley because NCS has been doing a Let's Play of that game, and that inspired me to get the game. And I've, I've already, like, I did one playthrough, and then I wasn't doing very good, so I started another new one. And I've already passed NCS again. Like, I'm in the middle of fall right now of the first year. Of course, I'm not the only one who's done that. A lot of people in the comments were talking about how they did that too. In fact, one person in the comments said that they had already gotten up to 40 hours of playtime. I'm like, Jesus Christ, dude. Because even if I combine my uh, previous uh, playthrough with my new one, or with my current one, it still wouldn't be 40 hours. Aw, oh, man, I messed up. Darn it, I missed my chance. I hate that. Perfect. Oh, nice. Okay. I love it when they just stay still and don't, you know, try and move out of the way or anything. Okay. Yep, yeah, stay still like that. Alright, good. Should almost be dead. I, you know, you don't even have to do this. You can literally just... I can literally just straight up go towards this guy and be like, Die! Alright. <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah, see? I finally get hit. Alright, got you. I thought for a second there I might have missed, but nope. I could skip this cutscene, but it looks cool, so I'm not going to. Besides, it reminds me of the original games way too much. Alright. That's another it one. It looks like you've gotten gradually better. Now, this is the last part. Yes, ma'am. Yes, this is Pi. Is there a problem? Detected epitaph users? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. Understood. We'll take care of it before it gets too big to handle. Huh? What's up? The Ida signal in this area is steadily rising. If we knew, we wouldn't work this hard. Why didn't Haseo say why? I had considered that the possibility weird. that the Epitaph's power was affecting Ida. But we've got too little data to know for sure. So, we've got to gather more data. <laughs> Alright, let's go do you that. Cut on quickly. Just to make it safe, we're going to defeat the last Ida. With my avatar. You got it? Oh, so you're gonna do it? Alright. Well, that. so much Don't for worry. training. I'll leave everything up to you, ma'am. And she doesn't respond to that at all? Okay, thank. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Alright, let's go. Let's see. Well, first, let's move on to the next area. And then let's use a fairy orb to see how much is left. Not very much, as you can clearly see. And, huh, interesting. Alright, well, let's go. Alright. Oh, hey, look at some of the lizard enemies I Your like to fight. Down. Your guard's down. Alright. 
Damn, let's get a bunch of Ringekis. And keep getting Tiger Blitzes. Alright. Like I was trying, I got all three Ringekis. See, that's why I like Heavy Blades, is because you can... You can get Ringekis really easily. Oh, whoa. Another new enemy. I didn't notice these guys. Um, you know what? I might as well fight these guys because this is like the first instance. Ugh, I can't even talk right now. It's the first instance of a shielded enemy. But see, once their shield is gone, then you can attack them. The thing that sucks about these enemies is that green smoke that you saw they were releasing. Because what the green smoke does is it inflicts a curse on you so you can't use your skills. And that's not good. And luckily, these enemies are a lot like, uh... Are a lot like the lizards where... Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. They're a lot like the lizards where you can, uh... Gosh, what am I trying to say? Where I can get Ringekis on all of them easily. I don't know why it's like that, where I'm trying to, like, attack during the, t uh, during the, uh... I'm trying to attack during the, uh, Awakening, but for some reason it wasn't, like, letting me. I don't know. <coughs> well, I'm level 26 and Pi is level 27 now, so that's good. Or not 27, or wait, not 27, 23, I don't know why I was thinking. Man, see, I'm just like so out of it right now, but I should do another episode after this one. I'm already up to, ugh, it's getting close to the, oh gosh, it's getting close to my time limit here. Um, I guess I have enough time to fight these guys. I'm wondering if I should probably just stop this episode before this part coming up, but no. Uh... Oh, don't kill him, don't kill him yet. Okay, don't kill it. Yes, alright, got all three Ringekis. Really? Ah, uh, see, I should have been grinding a lot more in this area. Because, see, I almost am level 27 now. It's all good, though. Alright, got healing serum. Let's move on. Let's move on to the final area. I only have about, like, 17 minutes to get through this, so... Huh, why are there normal players here? Yes, it sure was. But don't worry me like that. <laughs> but it was so much fun, wasn't it? What do you mean, fun? Please refrain from doing such a thing this time. But I like it! Hey, look out! Get away from there! Oh. Oh no, Pi! Oh no, she got hit by Ida. What's that gonna do? Hey, are you okay? Oh no. Run, Haseo! Kun, call Kun! Use uh, his there, there's not enough time. He has to. He has to data drain me. <sighs> no, no, <coughs> no, 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 no! Oh no. Whoa, what's going on? She's lost control. And now. Behold. 
behold her avatar. I'm not going anywhere. Even if I call Kuhn now, he'll never make it. Sorry, lady, but I think I've had just about enough of your lessons. Okay, oh, wait. I mean, I have 20 on. minutes left, not 17 minutes. I'm right here. See, it's a good thing I gained those two levels, right? Since now that's gonna make my uh, avatar stronger. I swear. I think eventually Haseo's avatar actually gets its own abilities and stuff. But, yep, Tarvos is her uh, avatar. See, so, yeah, I got her already. Bam. Jeez, wow, I guess uh, I really am over-leveled right now. Huh? Yeah? Attack. Sorry about that, everyone. I was. Uh, I, I had to talk real fast with my mom. Okay, let's continue. Uh oh, oh, she's gonna do a data drain. Yep, that's right. They can do data drain on you. And you might be thinking, oh crap, I'm screwed. But nope, not in this case. Because all you have to do to escape the data drain is just mash the buttons. Just smash buttons like it says. <laughs> Alright. And she's going to keep going from side to side. And I'm going to keep hitting her, but... Okay. Let's keep hitting her. Keep, keep it up. Keep it up. Alright, almost done. She's almost gone into her data drain mode. Yes. Alright, there we go. Protect break. Now I can do it. However, you gotta be careful because you gotta charge up. And see. Okay. Got her. Alright, yes. There we go. Did it. Dogs want in. Okay, come on in, babies. Hey, come on, snap out of it. <coughs> what are you doing? Now wake up! Wake up! Please wake up! I said wake up! Bye! Uh, hi. That's the first time. You've called me by my name. Oh, how embarrassing. Don't Not scare really. me like that. Um. Is she alright? Was she injured when she took the blow and tended for me? No, I'm alright. Please don't worry about it. Really? Gets up like Thank nothing you. happened. By the way, what was that black hole? Was it some kind of bug in the data? Yep. 
Yes, it was. We are part of CC Corp's volunteer support. We heard there was some corrupted data in this area, so we came to investigate. I'm terribly sorry, but we would appreciate it if you would refrain from playing in this area for a while. I understand. Then I will excuse myself for today. Allow me to thank you properly another day. Hmm. See, this kid is actually an important character. I guess that Avatar yes. fights really can't be seen by regular players. It's Isabel. Give Uncle a minute. Hmm? What's Uncle's wrong, trying to record right now. Those two. I God. think I've seen them before. Hey, are you okay? Did the inside of your brain get data drained too? Shut up. We're going back to town. <laughs> okay. 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 Phase 7 Epitaph. Alright, so now I can go and get the Beast Treasure and head back to town and stop for this episode. Because apparently I'm. I keep getting interrupted. <laughs> oh gosh. Man, this is just the interruption episode, right? I think there's still one more cutscene. Hopefully, it doesn't last too long because I've only gotten a. F uh, I only work, got a few yeah. minutes. Yeah. I need to go make a report to Master Yada now. You want to come with me? No. Uh, no, thanks. no thanks. That's what I thought. Okay then. See you later. Ooh. I'm joking. Alright, what's gonna happen next? Like, seriously, who designs their character like that? Alright, well, I will see you guys. Wait, hold on. Let me let me see if I've given any of these guys the flyer. Yep, I, I haven't given you one. Alright, let's see if you need one. What about you? Tress, Trespian, and Iga. Iga need one. Alright, well, see you guys next time.